All right. All right, everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome. It's your boy, Big Lloyd Dotson, and it must be hump day, Rich, because I saw some camels walking <laughs> around in the snow out there. They did get stuck because we got about two feet over the last week here uh, in no. the New York area. How about you guys? How are you doing across the pond there, my man, Rich Green? Yeah, really well, mate. Really well. We've had so much snow that we can't even see it. There's been a sprinkling. That's it, just a sprinkling. Oh, it's kind of one of those matrixes where you're kind of in it, but you're not in it. And so That's you can't it. See Something it. like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Somebody's told us there's snow. They say on the, on the TV that there's snow. You look out of the window, there's no snow. <laughs> oh, man. Well, again, if you're watching this, this is our weekly Hump Day Wednesday weekly live training that we do for our Boss XL Supercharged Sales Loop System. We call it our success and sales training. And what we do every week is we come to you live and we basically take apart the funnel and the system bit by bit and talk about the parts so that you can start to understand better why those parts are in there, why those programs are in there, and how you can learn them better so that you can put it back together and know why the system works so well. Once you understand it, you understand the psychology, you understand the program, you start to, guess what, have more confidence in it. And once you have confidence in something, people see that, and therefore you get more leads, you get more signups, signups ultimately lead to more sales. So today, what we thought we'd do is if you're watching this live, we want to thank you for joining us. We have a few people here today. I know there's some other trainings going on with some other parts of our system. Um, and that's fantastic. You want to make sure you catch those also. But at the same time, what we're going to cover today um, is a program that is relatively inexpensive when it comes to most things out there. You can actually start for only $7. And we introduce it as the first small emotional buy-in in the Boss XL Supercharged Sales Loop system. And we do it for a reason, not because it's cheap, but because it's such a fantastic vehicle for what you pay for. And so what we thought we'd do uh, is, again, I'm going to switch over so that you guys can see there are a number of people on the call um, here on the training, and they come from all over. We've got people from the UK. We've got people from Florida, that other, you know, uh, island that's off the south part of the USA. We've got people that's from nice Canada. Thing. We've got people from, uh, like my man Daniel there from uh, Sweden, and um, we've got a bunch of people that are going to be hopping on and off as they're catching other training as well as this, and we're happy that that's the case. And that shows that Boss XL, the supercharged sales loop system, really comes across for anyone. I'm sorry, I did say Sweden. It is Switzerland. I always make that mistake. Um, we've got uh, people from Scotland, um, again, all over the place. So we, we focus on the one thing that most gurus, not most, all gurus out there never, ever talk about. They talk about products and they talk about the next greatest tool and binaries and all that stuff, but they never talk about traffic. And the truth is, as Rich and I will show you, the most important thing in growing a successful uh, recurring income business is traffic. Doesn't matter what you're selling, doesn't matter what your service you're providing, you need eyeballs on your offer. But the truth is, most people look at traffic and it's either A, boring, or two, they don't understand how powerful it is. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to, um, I'm gonna mute my man Kelvin and Rich, I'm gonna let you take over to kind of introduce what we're gonna talk about today. And just remind the people again of Boss Excel and the five parts of it and why it's important that they understand each part the way that we break it down each week. No problem, buddy. No problem. Can everybody hear me loud and clear? Um, yes. Beautiful. Beautiful. Um, so just, just a, a quick one, first of all, for the guys who are watching this on the record, because I've had a couple of questions this week, which kind of made me smile a little bit. If you're watching this on record, what you don't get to see is you don't get to see the chat room. You don't get to see the live chat room where while I'm talking to you, these guys are interacting with big, asking questions, this and the other, and vice versa. And every now and again, you might see me or big snigger a little bit 
as one of the guys has got something witty or something to say about what's going on. You need to be on these gigs live so that you can really see. It's funny you say that, Rich, because tonight we rolled out uh, yesterday, actually, Valentine's Day, we received uh, the first order of our shirts. This happens to be the Boss XL mm -hmm. hashtag shirt. We have another, which is the straight logo. And my man, Eric, who's on the call here, uh, ordered his and got it right away in two or three days. That's how quick it is. But the funny thing about it is I was laughing because on the chat, he said, anybody ordering their shirts might need to order a larger size um, than they need. Mine shrunk a little. You sure it was the shirt, Eric, or maybe? <laughs> no, no, it's true. It's true. You want to order a size larger because it is full cotton T-shirt. It is a full cotton T-shirt. Um, but anyway, that's what we were laughing about. But you're absolutely right, Rich. The uh, chat, not only do we have fun in the chat, but there are also some great questions. That way we can basically keep track of the questions that people have. And we highlight a couple of those and have people come out live at the end uh, or even the middle sometimes to ask the question live. So you're absolutely right, Rich. Being on live is a huge difference than watching on replay. Go ahead. Marianne. Absolutely. Absolutely. So just to summarize what Big were talking about, the, the components of Boss XL, and then we'll get stuck into tonight's training uh, all about least ad space. So Boss XL itself uh, stands for, um, the BO stands for business opportunities, uh, the things that are going to make you money. The SS stands for success system. Now, success system is made up of five, components and I'm going to come back to that in just a second and then XL stands for exposure loop so exposure is essentially getting your business out there um, getting it in front of traffic which big touched on a couple of seconds ago but the loop is really important and that's the fact that the system's designed so that the money you generate the money that's made within it can be re-spent on more traffic, more exposure to bring you to a position where your earnings are in pocket earnings. Um, so it's a self-funding, self-perpetuating beast of a, uh, of a sales system. So that, that five uh, component success system that we spoke about is made up of uh, five key things. Number one, it's made up of traffic, some of which we're gonna talk about tonight, at least at space. It's made up of a funnel, uh, a sales funnel is a process of taking people from a point of interest to a point of uh, motivation to a point of taking action. Um, the third thing is a filter, uh, which is a way of getting rid of the, the tire kickers and the people who are just having a look, just for the sake of having a look. Um, as somebody who spent a lot of years talking to way too many tire kickers and wasting a lot of my time for no money, um, a filter is really, really important. Um, number four is follow-up. And so within the entire Boss XL system, we've already put together and we teach you how to build on an automated system of follow-up so that your system's working for you, whether you're working on it or not. And number five is tiered congruent products. And what we mean by that is the tiering aspect is starting low and taking people through an emotional journey of buying in. Very few people are in a position emotionally, financially, or otherwise to go large straight away. So starting small, helping people to gain confidence uh, in what's going on around them, gain knowledge, and gain enough income to work their way up through tiering and we're gonna today at least add space is that very bottom level that first thing at the start of the funnel the lowest entry level congruency that's just tying everything together making sure it's not just products thrown together for the sake of it but it's products that actually work so that's your five components that's your success system traffic funnel filter follow-up and tiered congruent products in, in that the just, that just kind of flows off the lips now uh, oh, Rich. Man, it's, and it's, it's, and it's like it's like thing. our mantra we're teaching everyone now and it's funny to see because we're seeing more and more leaders out there use the words congruent offers and traffic system success i wonder where they got that from hmm 
Who'd have thunk it? Who'd have thunk it? So <laughs> while, while you're getting your um, screen geared up, my man, we just want to remind everybody, if you are watching this on replay, make sure you get back to the person that shared it with you. One of the easiest ways to find out more about the Boss XL Supercharged Sales Loop System is to actually join our Facebook group. It is free to join. Uh, Rich and myself vet everyone that applies to join into the group. We just want to make sure that you're a real person, that you're not a member of 10,000 groups because you're a spammer, you're not for real, things like that. But the truth is, it is easy. In fact, we set up a website to make it easy for everyone to remember, and that's www.jointhefacebookgroup.com. That's right. Rich and I were laughing about this. Who would have thought that that domain would never have been taken? Oh, but www.jointhefacebookgroup.com. And the only Facebook group that you want to join is obviously the Boss XL Supercharged Sales Loop System. Once you're in there, make sure that you connect with the person that inspired, invited, or pushed you to get into the group or added you to the group so that you can work with them directly to have your Boss XL system up and running within a 24 hour period. We take it step by step by step. You'll wanna see their funnel, you'll wanna see their system, and then you'll be blown away as well. In addition to that, we, only, we do weekly trainings every Wednesday. We have a show called Pit Lane Power every Sunday. We have our uh, MVP, VIP type level people that work with us one-on-one um, -on -one every Sunday called the Winner's Circle. So there's lots and lots going on inside that group to help you become a better marketer. And one of the ways that you're going to do that is to learn each part of the system and why they're in there. And so Rich is gonna share step one, which is, well, technically it's kind of step one and a half because step one is joining the Facebook group, right, Rich? Absolutely. Step, step one point five is least ad space, my man. So let's go ahead and share least ad space and go into why we love this little program so much and why you've probably never heard of it. Because honestly, the big, commission junkies out there, the big leaders that like to hop from program to program, $7 commissions, that's the beauty of it. It's a 100% pass up commission when people purchase the rights and we'll explain more. But at $7, people just don't see it as sexy. We find it very, very sexy. And the people that go through the program are now learning and understanding why we love this little program so much. Go ahead, Rich. Absolutely. Missed opportunity. Massive missed opportunity for people. Uh, just again, talking to the guys watching it on record, you probably saw a lot of sniggers and a bit of laughter. Um, everybody, there's a lot of love going on on chat room for our boy John Bourne, who's just joined us. Um, John is actually on holiday. And if it looks like he's looking over his shoulder a lot, he's probably checking out for his wife to make sure that he's not going to uh, get in bother because he's supposed to be spending time with the family. Uh, good to have you here, buddy. Really good to have you here. Um, so let's jump into least ad space. I'm going to click share screen. Let me know if you guys can see my screen. There we go. Can you see my screen? Okay, everybody's on mute. Um, and I can't see your hands because I'm looking at my screen. <laughs> Rich, go back and uh, pop up Facebook there real quick and show people the group. Pop up your Facebook there. There we go. Let's get rid of So Winner's Circle members get their own private chat room, by the way. That's what you just saw me uh, closing. So, yeah, this is the, the actual Facebook group. We've just hit um, 1,164 members. Uh, we are growing massively by the day. It's a full-time job just adding people to the group. And this is where you're getting to see um, proof, progress, results, excitement, ask whatever questions you want, interact with other uh, normal and less normal, some of us, uh, people. Um, <laughs> Kelvin, who's on the Zoom with us, just jumped in to get a bit of FaceTime. I boss Excel is live. Um, so, so, yeah, there's, um, that's, that's an awesome awesome community to be a part of. So moving on, least ad space. If you've not been introduced yet to the Boss Excel system, then speak to whoever's been showing you this video or find out where you found it from and speak to those guys. And they're ultimately going to lead you down a path that's going to bring you here. So once you've joined least ad space, um, you've become a member, 
one of the first things that it's important for you to do, and I know there's going to be guys who are already members that haven't done this yet, <coughs> complete your profile. Your profile shows on your personal least ad space page. It shows on your least ad space blog. Um, people can track back to it when they log on, when they click on your links in your least ad space emails. So if your profile is incomplete, does that make you look like a professional marketer who they want to work with or do you look like an amateur? Um, I was having a conversation with somebody only earlier this week and they had been contacted by someone who'd been in least ad space for over a year but still hadn't completed their profile. Why? Because they didn't think anybody read it. Well, even if nobody read it, fill it out, for God's sake. Um, but there's a few details to fill in here. You want to make sure you've got all your payment provider details in there because that's, that's how you're going to get paid. You want to make sure that your solo settings are activated and you want to make sure that you've got a bit of a public profile so that people have a way of finding out more about you through social media. Um, you can add and update your videos, change those as frequently as you want, and you can put links direct to your top programs. So your Boss Excel system, for example, which some might call the perfect business combo, um, your um, conversion software, uh, which some might recognize as um, Online Sales Pro. So there's all sorts of things that you can get done just in your profile and you need to make sure that's complete. So the next thing that you're going to do once you're in here is you're going to make use of all of the advertising tools that are available to you. Now, how many of those tools will be available will depend on what level you are in the business. So I'm just going to go to how it works for a second. So as Big mentioned, $7 start. For $7, what you're going to get is 8,000 ad impressions, 4,000 text ads, and one solo email every 28 days. So for those of you who are not clear and aren't familiar with solo emails, a solo ad is a one-off advert, a one-off email that's written about you or your business or whatever you want and that's sent out on repetition to a large audience. Not sure what happened there, we've got somebody on, uh, on mic. Um, so, so yeah, a solo campaign is an email that's sent out en masse. This ad space is what's called a safe list. So a safe list is, um, it's a Sorry, I'm really distracted by that mic. Whose mic's on? Can we can let me just try yep, and I got I don't I got him. I got him. I just got to find them. We have so many people on now, so give me a chance to find them, but I'll track them <laughs> down. Know, I'll leave that Go you. ahead, Rich. So so least ad space is a safe list. So a safe list is just a list of people who've agreed to receive information. So if you've got information about your business, whether that be Boss XL or AN Other, you've got a list of people straight away for $7 that you can send that information to. Now, if you've been in the online marketing space for a while, you'll hear people talk about the money's in the list, the money's in the list. Your job is to build a big list, blah, blah, blah. And as a newbie, the idea of building a list of thousands of people can be massively daunting. Well, when you join Least Ad Space, you've automatically got a list of over 3,000 people. And for $7, you can email to that list once every 28 days for life. That's a one-off $7, by the way. Now, you Rich, can... talk about when you say you have 3,000 people you can mail to. Um, hmm. You're talking about a safe list here. And have people quickly understand where those 3,000 members are come from when you say 3,000 members you've got? What, what do you mean by that for people that are saying, okay, for $7, I'll take a whack at it. But talk hmm. about the membership aspect. Well, when you join Lease Ad Space, you become a, uh, a member of that safe list. You become one of those 3,000. And that's why it's growing by, at the minute, it's growing by about 150 people a day. 
And so the, the membership is business opportunity seekers. It's business opportunity owners. It's home-based business owners, people in network marketing. And it's the work from home niche. So if you've got a tool, a resource, a system, a product, something that's of benefit to that niche, then for seven dollars, I did big calls it a punt. Yeah, great, punt away. Yeah, and, and and Rich, the reason I bring that up is when you and I first joined this not that long ago, um, three thousand seemed like a distant number, but we looked at the fact that even at three thousand back then, it was only basically a thousand. But that means that we got to essentially get our message in front of people over and over and over. If you look at the other packages in here, and that's why we're so excited because again, it's only 3000 people. So you're getting an opportunity to get in on something that is only growing exponentially as mm -hmm. time goes on. You talked about it. I remember the days you and I both do when it was only maybe, you know, five, 10 people being added per day. Now we're up over 10 times that 150 people per day. And that's uh, only going to grow. Absolutely. absolutely. We, we, we were in a traffic business not that long ago that had over 3 million members. It doesn't take businesses that long in the online space to gain traction. And so when you've got the opportunity for $7 to post out to volume, because there's no restriction on how many people it's sent to, it's sent to the entire list, however big the list gets. Now, as you um, promote least ad space, we'll touch on the money shortly, you earn money. And you remember me mentioning the loop at the start, um, taking the, the sales loop into context? Well, what you're gonna do is you're gonna use your profits from promoting least ad space, and you're gonna work your way up through the, pra uh, through the traffic packages. The more you spend, bearing in mind these are still one-off amounts, the more you spend, the more advertising you get. And so you'll start off, with one solo campaign every 28 days. And, and this, pit, this bit's not very sexy. Um, then you'll get to one every 14 days. Then what we suggest everybody does is they get themselves as quickly as they can to the Emerald package. And if, that's, if you've got to start with money out of your own pocket to get to the Emerald package, as long as you've got the money in your pocket, do it. Yeah, Rich, let's, let's talk about that because we get asked that question quite a bit, you know, mm. Should I just stay at the $7 level? No, ideally the packages are such, when you look through them, you'll understand when they step up, but these are one-offs. These are not monthly uh, buy-ins, these are one-offs. So as, as Rich said, we're telling people more and more, you know, uh, if you look at it as a business, uh, the sweet spot right off the bat, uh, would be looking at the Emerald package. We're not saying that you have to have that. We introduce the $7 level as that low ticket buy-in to introduce you to traffic and solo ads. But the beauty of it, like Rich was about to say, and I'll let him continue, look at what you get basically for $7, then 17, and then 27. You have to buy at each level. You can't come in at a certain level. You have to buy each level to get uh, the uh, permission for that level. Um, but once you've spent, basically that 24 and then that additional 27. So we're talking $51, basically 50, sorry, uh, right? Did I do that? Did I do yeah. that 24? Yes, exactly. $51. Um, you <laughs> essentially uh, now get to, to do exactly what Rich is going to, to talk about. And he's going to show you how extremely uh, valuable and value cost conscious it is for, for spending 51 bucks. Go ahead, Rich, my man. No problem, buddy. Value cost conscious. I like that. <laughs> so yeah, you, you're getting a lot of exposure. You remember the exposure loop. Exposure is key to everything. Uh, you're getting a lot of exposure for not a lot of money. And these emails get more frequent and frequent. Now, some people might say, well, these people, that they've, they've said that they're going to get my emails, but they're only here for the same reason as I am, because they want to make money. Well, yeah. That's part of the point. If you're able to assist them in making money by providing something that assists them in that endeavor, then that positions you better. But you're absolutely right in what you're thinking. A lot of these people are only going to open these emails because they're incentivized to do so. 
when you're a member of Least Ad Space, Least Ad Space forces you to do one thing and one thing only as a member. And that's open a certain number of emails before you can send your solo campaign. So you're only paying for it once, and then each time thereafter, you don't have to pay again, but what you do have to do is look at some other members' emails. So people are going to open your emails every nine days as a member of the Emerald Package. As you work up and work up and work up, you're getting it more and more frequent. If your emails are being sent out on a really frequent basis, what likelihood do you think there is that they're going to be seen more often? Whether people are opening them because they're incentivized to or because they want to. Now, an important point to uh, stress is that we have training on writing emails. We've got emails that are pre-written for you that you can use. Uh, so there are ways to not just incentivize, but to motivate people to open your emails also. But the best way to make sure your emails are being opened is not to have the best subject header. It's not to have the best content. It's to send them more often than anybody else. Boom. That is the everything that we talk about when it comes to having success in business it's getting more exposure more eyeballs on your offer more traffic to the offer and so so many people see ads that they talk about getting tired of on the television on the radio why do you think that is do you think that they continue to pay for those ads because they're not working no People eventually, there's, there's the curiosity factor that comes in. And this is the same thing. The more that you can continue to see and the more the person sees that, there's a curiosity factor. Is there a hate factor? Yes. But ultimately, people's biggest haters are the ones that want to see what the hell you're doing. And so Rich and I always laugh about that, all right, that we love the fact that you can send a whole bunch of emails as long as you do them properly that are geared toward getting someone to a funneled system like boss Excel that takes them step by step through the path. And that's the beauty of a system like least ad space, because he just said it. The bottom line is you get to keep basically throwing that crap against the wall. If there's an old saying, if you throw enough against the wall, some of it's going to stick. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Now, we're not saying it's crap here because you have people that are other marketers. And other marketers are always looking for ways to, guess what, make more money or have a different marketing system. And the beauty about this is, as Rich said, when you're taught the proper way, okay, to craft those messages over and over and over, you'll start to see some conversions happen from that. So keep going, Rich. Great stuff, my man. I, I, I'm, I'm going to drop a little, um, what, what's the word? What's the word I'm looking for when you drop something of value? Um, anyway, I'm, I'm going to drop in a little tip. These trainings, by the way, these Wednesday night trainings, these are the basic trainings. These are the how to make the systems work that are in the system. Yes, we love seeing experienced guys on here and we always want experienced guys on here because repetition is the master of learning. But ultimately, these trainings are aimed at the people who are fresh to the system so that they can get their head around exactly what it is they've got their teeth into. So if you're watching this on record as an experienced guy, make sure you're getting this out to your new team members so that they can see the, the deeper um, ability behind the system so that they can get to use it. But whether experienced or new, I'm going to drop a little, um, a little gem that some of you will take notice of, although I guess it will be very few, and some of you will just forget about entirely. I know very, very, very well a seven-figure marketer. And that seven-figure marketer sends the same email time and time and time and time and time and time again. What he doesn't do, because I often get asked, how do you come up with new content for your email? In fact, we did a training on it on Sunday, didn't we, buddy? About creating content and how to write your email broadcasts and how to make them captivating and build them around what's happened today. He's a seven-figure earner. And what he does is he has one email that he sends over and over. Now, just think about that from a least ad space point of view. So... As members, those 3,000 people on Least Ad Space are being barraged with emails from the other 3,000 members. 
And if every single member is writing a different email every single time their emails go out, where's the ability to recognize somebody? What I'm saying is a couple of you, I think, will be smart enough to write yourself a really good email, draft it up, and every time your solos do, whether it be every five days, every four days, every 48 hours, or every whatever, you'll send the same email. And you'll start to be recognized because people will just recognize that email. So that's just a little tip. Whether people take notice or not, that's completely up to you. Um, hey, Rich, there, there used to be, um, back in the uh, 50s, um, an ad campaign in the United States uh, called Borax, and it was for um, you know, cleaning and all like that. And every two miles on billboards, you'd see the ad over and over and over and over. And did, they would, did they change the answer? Was it all mixed up or was it? Slightly, slightly. But the bottom line is the message was always the same. That's why mm -hmm. companies come up with the same jingle, the same tagline, and use it over and over and over. Because ultimately, subconsciously, it sticks anyway. And so that's a great tip, Rich. Now, we're not saying that you should be lazy, <laughs> okay? But we are saying that it doesn't take a whole lot of thinking, it takes much more effort. Mm -hmm. And the beauty is, again, as you go through here, you see that red diamond package, which I have, all right? You can send a solo email once every 48 hours. What do you think is gonna make more of an impression on people in that list? As Rich said, they're gonna see thousands of emails, but if you can send your email, solo email to that list every two days, okay? And essentially for, you know, weeks on end, it's the same email or a slight variation of that. Curiosity, I talked about it earlier. If you throw enough crap against the wall, curiosity is going to take over and they're going to go, Jesus Christ, this e email again? What, let, me, let me see what this is all about. Click. Exactly. Marketing stats say that it takes between seven and 12 exposures before people make a buying decision. So you want people to see your shit. Your, excuse, sorry, this is the public. <laughs> you, you want people- I I'm, said crap. You come I'm, out. Think, I'm thinking at we're least, on the- At floor. least say shite like you do across the pond. Come on yeah. now. Now, Rich, sorry, why- boys. But, Sorry, but, boys and girls. <laughs> but Rich, um, but why would they want to buy least ad space? Why, I mean, why do we have it as the first- Step, let's talk about that. It's great to go a little deeper, like we said, and I think we may be getting too far away. Step one is to introduce and get them to buy into least ad space. Um, so maybe instead of just hypothetically, why don't you go ahead and show them some examples of what you've been doing and other things? Because again, not only is there the solo ad, but you also have banners, right? Mm -hmm. And text ads, Absolutely. all for the same price. It's not. Yeah, it's, all, it's all included. Um, here's, here's what you get. This is your benefit. So text ads is these little things, you see, and, and you'll find them all over the site, but also when your emails are sent out, also on your blogs. So when people, let's say for talking, say someone is Googling a question, um, like how do you um, search for old Facebook posts in a Facebook group, um, just as an example. When they Google that, if you've written a blog on it, and it's a well-written blog, your blog's going to come up. So somebody's on Google, and they're now looking at your blog that's been written about that. Meanwhile, around the blog is these text ads. So they're a great little thing to have. You've got banner advertising, which you've just seen, the solo ads we've touched on, your profile page we talked about right at the very start, really, really important, and your own personal blog, which we're going to touch on in just a second. Now, do you want to do money now or do you want to do money at the end? Do, you, do, we, do we tease people about what they can earn in this? Yeah, let's show them. Those little 7s, 17 and 27s add up because as we said, the beautiful thing about this is this is a peer-to-peer -peer, uh, network that essentially you're purchasing the rights for that package to be part of this membership and there's a pass up. And so let's talk about that because um, it's an important part of it, um, Rich. Mm, absolutely. So when, when people join, um, signing up is free, but of course there's no point signing up if you're not gonna do anything. So generally speaking, everyone once they go active will be starting 
at the $7 level. You have to go 7, 17, 27, like Big mentioned. This is a matrix system. So there's only so many positions available in your business. So when you join, you have eight positions available for pearl purchases. So eight people who start will pay $7 to be pearl members and you'll earn those $7. They'll be paid direct to you, not to least ad space. They're paid direct to you. So you've got the opportunity to earn $56. Go and Rich, earlier I did the math and I said if you personally went up to the Emerald level, you would pay paying 51 out of your pocket. So yeah. all you would need to do is get eight people and you're completely covered. But it's actually easier than that because you yourself wouldn't personally have to get all those people. But you can talk about that in a little bit, but go through each level. Yeah. So, so you've got eight slots on your Pearl level. Now, let's say you continue to work, you continue to promote the system that we've built for you if you get involved in the whole gig. And so you get a ninth person join, a tenth person join, and so on and so on. Well, there's no room on your Pearl level. So you're not going to be paid the $7 for them. That $7 is going to go to somebody else in the organization. Now, there's 64 positions available on your Amethyst level. And so as those people buy the $17 gig, the $17 package, you're paid that. When these people join, they pay $7, the same as everybody else does, but because they're not on your Pearl level, you don't earn that seven. You earn 17 from them. So they're worth more. When that level is filled, you start filling up your emerald level and again when they pay seven dollars you're not getting that when they pay seventeen dollars you're not getting that but you're getting the 27 when they pay their 27 dollars and so on and so on and so on and it works that way all the way through now to put it into context if you look at the right hand side of the screen big mentioned the 56 dollars that you earn from people joining your pearl level once you start to build your organization your earning potential becomes really interesting. And this is where it does get sexy. And we know you can't run a business based on spreadsheet predictions. We don't think for one minute that you're gonna become millionaires over the course of the next 12 months by promoting least ad space. But the potential for people to really upscale in this business is huge. So let's have a look at what you can do in here. These are your advertising tools. So they're really self-explanatory. There's not a lot of training we can do in here other than, right, I've got no text ads left, um, other than um, showing you, right, okay, I've sent too many solo ads, um, other than showing you how to follow your way through the system. Everything has a real step-by-step -step approach to it. Where I've just gone, sorry, I was talking as I did it. Um, I've gone into my personal blog. I've gone into draft post and this is your own blog so this is your opportunity to write whatever you want about whatever you want it doesn't even have to be about business if you don't want it to be you might be writing about your holiday you've just got back from austria um, and you want to talk to people about this great chateau that you stayed in um, because the owners promise you a discount next time you go back john um, or whatever's gone off in your life. You can write about whatever you want. We've just done on Sunday a great training on um, blog writing and completing content. So I'm not going to go too heavily into how to use No, that. you're not, Rich, because one of the beauties of stepping up to our winner's circle is you get all types of training at the higher level. Um, some very ninja like tactics, but the beautiful thing about this and why Rich is just showing this, he's not actually going to go into detail is the blog is free for everyone, even at the $7 level, but let's show them some of those samples of the, of the blog there, but also the samples of the text ads and the banner ads. And then we want to cover the, uh, directory also. So go ahead, Rich. Yeah, so I'm in the ad blog right now. So your ad blog is, it's literally that. This is the blog of ads that have been put together by people and you can use these. These are essentially the emails.
that people are sending out um, in list format. So you can look through these and you'll notice it says click to earn credit. Most people in lease ad space think that they've got to open their email box to find the emails that are sent to them. Oh, wait then, a minute. Oh, one of those ninja tactics coming. Go ahead, my man. <laughs> so when, when you receive emails from Lee Sad Space, people think that you've got to open each one individually, click on the link, and look at each one of those Shh, websites. This is only for you watching this. Yeah, this is only for the people live. Don't let the people who are watching no. this one recorded know about it. Um, so what you can do, instead of opening each email individually, you can just come to the ad blog and you can click to earn your credit. Now see what happens. Please wait eight seconds, seven seconds, six seconds, five seconds, so on and so on and so on. So this is somebody's advert that they've put inside their solo email. Yeah, now this might be one of yours who's watching, I don't know. But I've claimed that credit. And so then I can go back to the blog and continue. Basically, before I can send another solo campaign of my own, I have to look at, I forget whether, is it 11 or 15 emails? I just keep looking at them. Um, but you've got to look at a set number of emails. So I use the ninja tactic. I find it quicker and easier to just come into the ad blog. Yeah. Oh, that one's got sound. Let me switch that down a bit. Okay, so from the credit. Now, obviously, I'm on a uh, training and with you guys, so I'm not looking in the slightest at what's on those emails. Yeah, but the reality yeah, is, yeah, as an yeah, online yeah. marketer, I'm always looking for tools, resources, products, services, tips, trainings, anything that can help me to grow my business. And that's just what you guys should be doing too. What you should also be doing is looking at the emails themselves and thinking about, right, how does that headline capture my interest? How does the layout of the ad work for me? Using this as a training ground, we call least ad space your training wheels because there's so much that you can learn from both doing and observing what other people have got going on. For, for basically $7 and Rich, so, so basically for $51, let's say that's the sweet spot, all right? Mm. You're basically paying that, and if you looked at it like we do from a marketer standpoint, it's, it's a, it is training wheels. We talk about it all the time, but look at all the great opportunity you have to learn from other marketers, good and bad, mm -hmm. for basically at the sweet spot, $51 in total. You see, we start to teach people inside Boss XL to look at things differently. Don't look at it as a money-making program. Look at it as an educational opportunity for you to be able to take and put that back into the loop as we talk about so that you can leverage to make more money because you actually understand, start to understand that it's a business based on traffic eyeballs exposure. Absolutely. Uh, even as, as daft as it sounds, even seeing banners, you know, you can learn so much as a new person, new to the online space, that banner, yes, kind of lost, we show you the way. Is that uh, a that banner is kind of lost itself because you can't see it. Is, is that a sat nav business? Is that a mapping company? Is that um, geocaching? Is that, what the hell is it? We don't know. Um, but you can learn from that. So yeah, look at look at everything through different eyes to what you will have done in the past. Your text ads that I spoke about are these things down the side, uh, grayed out at the back, red font. Um, so $6 for every lead you generate, want lightning fast commissions. A lot of you guys will know exactly what that is before you click it. And that's relatively good marketing in some ways. There's two ways to look at it. You don't want people to make a decision before they click your ad. Or do you? Do you want the only people to be clicking your ad, people who are actually bum, interested? Bum, bum. Hmm. That's a question. <laughs> Um, so, so yeah, there's many ways to look at things, um, but a, a seven or a fifty-one dollar start to a set of training wheels that can help you open your eyes to marketing and expose your business is a pretty uh, decent setup. Does so, that Rich, so, Rich, let's give them an idea of um, one of the um, solos that you've written recently. 
And of course, we're going to be biased and really uh, pushing people to um, look at the Boss XL system because it's all inclusive with not only leased ad space, which we're talking about here today, but also uh, Future Ad Pro, which is a traffic exchange that you can get started with as little as $10. The sweet spot there are the $50 ad packs. And then obviously the system that we built Boss XL on, which is online sales pro, which starts at $37 a month. Um, and when you put all those steps together, you have a pretty powerful system built around traffic. On top of that, we throw in our top tier 90% plus uh, solo ad traffic service that we have called Accelerate Traffic. And uh, people are absolutely loving that traffic there. And we throw in a bonus at the end, once again, traffic, educational-based, motivational-based, uh, called Exodus Elite as a bonus. But you can get started for as little as $54 in the first three steps. Leased ad space for as little as seven, um, future ad pro for as little as $10, and then online sales pro for as little as 37, which allows you to put this whole system together. Um, and we have a, a website uh, that takes you step by step with pictures, videos, etc., that show you how to do it. Um, if you want to take that path and get started with the Boss XL, make sure you get back to the person that shared this link with you so that they can share their funnel with you so they can help you get set up your own Boss XL system in less than 24 hours and have you start to earn from the system itself. But let's, um, let's Rich, share some of the things that you've recently written uh, to send out to people also. Yeah, no problem, buddy. So um, notice the headline, the subject header, the number one tip for LAS members. So the 3,000 plus people that this is going to, what have they all got in common? They're all least ad space members. And in likelihood, they're all looking for a way to get the best out of it. So having subject headers that capture their interests is important. Um, yes, like I said, some of them will be opening these emails randomly just because they want the credit. But what about the ones that aren't? Think back to the story I told you right at the very start about the guy who didn't fill out his profile because he thought no one looked at it. But what about the people who do? So just think from the other side of the uh, other side of the fence, really. Now this e this email is you'll notice one of the things that I do is I use the different fonting just to make it a little bit more interesting, a bit easier to read. I use paragraph spacing. I use decent grammar. Now, you don't necessarily have to be the, the best copywriter in the world. And if you know you're the worst copywriter in the world, keep your emails short uh, so you, it, there's less chance for you to, to make it problematic to read. Um, but yeah, make it interesting and easy on the eye and decide clearly what do you want from this particular email what I wanted from this is I want people joining our Facebook group because when they join our Facebook group they're gonna see real people just like you guys they're gonna see excitement they're gonna see success they're gonna be wanting to get involved in the boss XL system at which point I can then present them with my boss XL link they can go through my funnel system and join all three parts and so it's using the uh, Facebook group as what I call is a safe zone. You'll see here, my top tip is use all of the advertising that you can afford to buy to drive traffic to a safe zone. A safe zone somewhere to warm people up, get them to see the value of what you do, and then they'll want to join you. Free value is what I'm giving in this email. I'm providing people with free information um, that they may or may not have received anywhere else, but they at least feel like they've not opened it just for the sake of So opening. Rich, let's do this. Great tip there. Don't get out of that. What I want to do is let me go and let me bring out a couple of people who might have a question because you covered a lot, my man. And I think the best thing to do is let's bring out um, a couple of people live so they can ask their question. Um, and we will do that. So if you have, all right, so my man Daniel from Switzerland, um, Daniel, unmute and come out and ask your question about the six traffic package benefit, uh, et cetera, et cetera, my man. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, here on the uh, six traffic benefits on this page, it's uh, on uh, position six, it's the Classified ads directory that's written coming soon. Seems to be not not ready, <laughs> or is it? 
already ready? Rich, you got that, my man? As, what, what's this? It's this the the the, the block, the X block, or? Oh, the yeah, the the my understanding is, and I've not got a completely perfect answer for you. I'll I'll tell you as much as I know, which is probably not much more than you do at this stage. Um, but they are looking at having the classified ad directory, so so not the blog, um, the ad directory, uh, the the one that we were just looking at, um, that's got all the adverts in it. They're looking at having that SEO'd. Right. So at the minute, at the minute, if you write a blog post. That is spidered by Google. It's just the same as any other blog post that's out there on the World Wide Web. And it can be ranked by Google if it's written well and if it's full of keywords. It keywords, right, exactly. Um, at the moment, the classified ad uh, directory, the ad blog as it's called on this menu, um, that's not linked to any SEO in. That's, that's inside the least ad space and not readable. So what they're looking at doing is having that accessible by Google spiders, Bing spiders, those kind of things, so that they can be picked up on and searched for on Google. Awesome. Hopefully that, that helps you, Daniel. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you. When is it coming? I don't know. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, that's what but it is. it's a great answer because, um, again, it has a lot to do with um, – with SEO, and obviously they're moving toward that because as the network grows, they obviously want to give those benefits to all of us um, at those higher levels to get our ad blog seen more and more, as, as Rich talked about, definitely. All right, so I think we have one other question. Someone else, if you had a question, can you pop it back in? Because man, the chat is long. I'm loving, I'm loving how the audience has grown while I've been looking at my screen. Yeah, and absolutely. Got, got a trucking marketer on, actually <laughs> driving, driving along doing his thing and listening to this. That's a bit, a bit naughty, Anthony. Pat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shout out to my man, a Anthony. Anthony, they basically, uh, the dude market. is driving his truck. Absolutely. Absolutely. So I think we had um, one other question. I think we lost that person earlier. Um, yeah. Oh, um, there was a question earlier um, on the profile. Um, Rich, you talked about completing the profile. And mm. then um, in there, um, it had the video and you kind of glossed over that. Is that yeah. video a introductory video for the person? Or is that a sales marketing video? Because there's the two links Wait. underneath. Okay, go ahead uh, with the CTA. And yeah. you skipped over what CTA is. So maybe you can talk about that and then talk about the video because you don't have one, I don't have one. Um, and part of that is we're trying to figure out the best way to leverage that video. So talk yeah, about that. Well, personally, I don't think that video has to be a static thing. You can, you can change it and update it as you need to. Um, but essentially, that's going to be on your profile picture, which is going to be exposed to other... Uh, least, ad space, least ad space members um, to other marketers. So just a, a great intro video. You guys have already been working on intro videos for your email campaigns. It may well be if you've done them really generically and not related to, hi, welcome to my email list, you've gone, hi, welcome to me, then you can use that. Um, it may well be that you want that to be a, a, a kind of leading video into what's listed in your call to actions which is the CTA that um, the big were just talking about. Your two favorite programs there may well be congruent programs, and perhaps you want that video to be a congruent link to those. Um, so you can, you can kind of play around with this. It, as I say, it, it genuinely is your training wheels. Yeah, uh, we, we don't have an answer to that. That was a great question. Um, again, like I said, a couple of people had to jump off because there's other training, but that was a great, great question because it really depends on where you want to lead people. Um, you know, it could be as, as uh, Rich said in the profile, which is seen and it's out there, uh, those call to actions, they give you two places for links. If you want that video to introduce, you specifically point down below and say, you know, the first offer is this and the second offer is this. Guess what? That's a call to action in itself in the video itself. So it all depends on what you want to do. We can't 
tell you that there's a specific. All depends on what you're trying to accomplish inside Least Ad Space. If your focus is only on Boss Excel and the programs inside, then obviously it's to your advantage to do an introductory video, reference the links below, and then get those people, as Rich said, we find the easiest way to get them to join the Facebook group, which is why we set up the www.jointhefacebookgroup.com. We, we're not saying you have to do that, but the path of least resistance to kind of close that gap so that people feel that they can get in touch with you easier may be a way to do it. But again, we're not saying that that is. But the beautiful thing about the profile is, as Rich said, there's every opportunity, not only in your description to throw links inside your description or bio, but there's also the video and the two links with calls to action. So least ad space really is about for very little money getting more eyeballs on your offer. That's why we love it so much because it's so packed with ways to, um, like Rich talked about, it's the training wheels, it's the training ground for other parts of the funnel and the system. And you can do it in that safe list environment. And why do we like and keep using that word safe list, Rich? Because if they tried some of these things to regular solo ads or Facebook advertising, in most cases, what would happen? Yeah, it, in most cases, it, you're going to get flagged. You're going to get blacklisted. Your stuff's going to go in spam. Um, and, and you're going to waste your money because it's going to cost you a fortune to do it in the first place. You're paying for premium traffic that way. Um, safe list traffic is cheap for a reason. And so you will get results from it if you're smart about it. Most people won't get results from SafeList because they do the same thing as they're doing elsewhere. You've got to work a little smarter. So, uh, so yeah, yeah, use it for, for what it's designed for. So um, let's, let's piggyback off that. I have one more question, um, Rich, and then we're going to basically shut it down uh, for the day. Um, I'll let her come out and ask her question and um, we can answer that real quick and then we will um, uh, shut it down. We'll have a hard call to action at the end as we always do. But our vendor, you had a great question having to do with the videos, uh, Facebook Live, YouTube, that type of thing. So why don't you unmute yourself, come out and um, ask that question and uh, I'll let my man Rich handle that one. Um, hi Rich, I just wanted to ask um, with the videos, where do you do them? Do you do them like Facebook Live? Do you open up a YouTube account? I wasn't sure what the best way is. For, for the videos specifically to go in least ad space or, or more generically? Because for, oh, for least ad space and how is it hosted? How's the video hosted? So what's the best way? Setting, all you need to put in is the embed HTML. So if your video is hosted on YouTube, when you click share, it brings up underneath, um, how do you want to share it? Do you just want to copy the link or do you want the embed code? So the embed code, not to go too in depth, is just the, the computer code, the HTML, for burying your video inside the website. So least add space, just ask for the, in fact, just, just let me jump on screen share. I'll show you for a second. That'll be quicker. Absolutely. See, see, it's, it's, it's big boss and, and geek boss, <laughs> nerd boss. <laughs> Rich and I keep joking going back and forth about, you know, what should he, what should his moniker be? And uh, he keeps, he keeps waffling between <laughs> those two. Yeah, what yeah. is it? I'm, what is I'm, it this I'm, week? I'm, Rich? Analyzing the, I'm analyzing the options, dude. That's what I'm doing. I'm analyzing the options. <laughs> So let's look at um, a least ad space video for talking. So least ad space. So anyone will do. Um, there we go. Right. Business every single. There we go. Straight from the owner of least ad space. So can you see my screen? Yes. Awesome. So you'll notice the share here. Click share, and then what happens is you've got what most people are used to seeing. Just copying the link. What most people miss are these two options. So that is the embed code. So what you'd do is you'd just copy that into... Um, there you go. There. Boom. See, and that's important because then least ad space is hosting your video in your profile as opposed to a link. What's the quickest way to make a video and where, where do you recommend I should go? 
Quickest is to uh, take your phone, shoot a video, upload it to YouTube and uh, do exactly what Rich talked about. And uh, the great thing about, uh, you know, that is you can just quickly Google ways to shoot quick videos and, and upload and host to YouTube. There's so much information out there. Like I said, most people think they have to do things fancy, but the truth is people like to do pe business with real people. Um, so that's the most important thing is to actually do it as opposed to thinking you have to do it perfectly. Do you know, do you know what I'd do if I were you, Arbinda? Yep. Yeah, I would connect with Mimi. Mimi has literally just done her first couple of videos. So it would be really good for you to speak to somebody who's literally just done it. Now, what, what I'm also going to do very quickly is just double check the advice that I've just given you all um, about, because I don't like the way that looks. Um, I think I may well be wrong um, because it's asking for That's the a URL. Yeah. It's, it's not the embed code. Yeah. Embed at the start, but it says URL afterwards. Because, right? Yeah. That's it's changed. Yep. Exactly. Yeah. So, good so you pick up, good, oh, pick, my good pick up rich because it does mm -hmm. ask for the embed code, but it actually says URL. Yeah. So if you put the URL, what it does is it opens YouTube as a page and shows it like you'd normally see. Yep. If you put the embed code, it opens the video as your entire screen, which some people would argue is better. So it's whichever you prefer. Do you guys follow that? You can do it either way, depending if you want to take people away to YouTube or open up as um, a full screen video. We'll just right? show you that quickly again. So that's the URL. That's doing it the URL way. Yeah. Hello, my friend. So they might, yep. well, they might well leave the page and look at other people's videos. Or if you do the embed code. Right. So technically it shouldn't say embed URL. It should say embed code. Yeah. Because it's yeah. not an actual URL per se, but anyway, that's, that's what we mean. Yeah. Well, that's been, that's been a worthwhile exercise. Just seeing that, buddy. There you go. And on that note, thank you very much, Arvinder. Great question, by the way. So that has been a least ad space uh, for today in our weekly Boss Excel Supercharged Sales Loop Success and Sales Training. And um, each and every week, we'll break down uh, parts and programs inside the Boss Excel system. As we said, the most important thing that you can do is if you're watching this on replay, get back to the person that shared their link with you, go through their entire funnel system, um, and at the very least, join us in the Facebook group. That's www.jointhefacebookgroup.com. And in there, um, we actually uh, will say, our vendor, go and pop your question about making videos inside the group. Uh, we're going to start putting together accountability partners in the group for things like that. But yes, Mimi did some great videos recently, and she could take you through that process. Um, we also want to just highlight that every week we do this live training, and we take and we put the recorded sessions inside the file section of our Facebook group. So everything that we do, record, the training we do, all of that, um, email swipes, uh, everything. There's just a ton of stuff that we keep adding to the files section so that you can understand as much as possible about the system. One of the things that people love about Rich and myself, unlike other gurus, leaders, whatever the hell you want to call people that do training like we do, um, is we're, we're real, raw, unscripted. But we also, just like we do, we, um, we share our back offices. We're not afraid to show you our success or lack of success or whatever it may be. It's not to brag. It's just simply to show you real time, uh, real proof, real progress, real results, rather than photoshops and you know piles of money and stuff like that. Which guess what? Prove nothing other than the fact that um, you know you've got a lot of people that you took money from. What we truly want to do, while we do these trainings so openly, is um, Rich and I want to create other bosses, other leaders, and we're trying to instill that you not only can do, see there's an old saying that says those that, um, that can't do teach. Those that can't do teach. I say complete bullshit, since Rich has already used the shit uh, verbiage there, that those that can do can also teach. It's whether or not they choose to. And most of the people out there that are the big you know, commission leaders and all like that, don't want to teach you their secret strategies, ninja things, because guess what? That puts you 
at an advantage of not needing to sign up with more and more things with them. So we're turning the industry a little on its head and people are calling us crazy for it. But at the same time, people are also seeing that we're very sincere. And if we can help you be successful little by little, we're not promising get rich quick, but we are having people understand that ultimately your success, no matter what business you're in, depends on one thing and one thing only, my man. Right, Rich? What is that? Sorry, man. I was distracted by something that was going on in the chat room. There's only one thing that matters when it comes to having success or failure in business. Action. Absolute action. That's all it boils down to. Action and traffic. <laughs> so on that note, we're going to do what we always do. We're going to unmute everyone, have them come out, say goodbye. We'll hit the stop button. But here's the thing. If you're on live, we stay on for another 30 minutes answering people's specific questions that's not recorded. And there's a reason because we want you to join us live next time. So on that note, what we're going to do is my man, Rich, we're going to unmute everyone and have them all come out and say goodbye. Same time, same channel. Same place next week, everyone. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye, Bye. Bye everyone. Hello. Bye-bye. Cheers. Bye-bye.